Hey, um, so the movie we're reviewing today is Night of the Living Dead. <laughs> Classic, right? It's really brilliant because it's hard to appreciate now of all of the crappy zombie movies that just seem to pop out of nowhere. But for the time, this is the, the mother and father of zombie movies. This is where it all came from, which is so cool. That aspect of it is, it's awesome. I mean, now the movie itself, it's meh. But the fact that this thing spawned so many other movies of like, I think it spawned a genre, is so cool. Let's, let's kind of get into the film first. Um, so we have our good friend, Barbara. Such a good friend, yeah. And Barbara, Barbara, oh, Barbara, what can we say about Barbara? Well, we know that she's the only actress on IMDb for Night of the Living Dead that actually has a picture. That's impressive. That's good on you, Barbara. Um, the extent of her acting is... He has the keys. Ah, that's all she does the entire movie. She stares at the walls. And what did you do when you went in there to try out for this role? Were they like, how well do you stare at the wall? <laughs> Let me try it real quick. Oh, you are a natural. Oh my. Oh my god, you are good. You have it. Oh, yes. We have her. Yeah, that's all she does. And then she dies. It's like, okay, good. Our buddy Ben. Like, this African-American dude comes in in his lead role in the 1960s, which is so cool. In the same year that Martin Luther King Jr. died, which is... George A. Romero was like, to hell with you. Like, he didn't care, and he put this guy in and it was it's awesome that is one of the coolest things about the movie it's so cool the fact that he's really the only good actor in the movie Dwayne Jones good on you bro good on you good on you for knowing how to act yeah good job hmm Harry this is that guy that you meet and he never wants to be wrong and so you have to like feed him like you have to make him think that these ideas are coming from him even though they're not He's that guy. And you hate him from the moment the movie starts. Like, from the moment he enters the film, you're just like, this guy, this guy, I know this guy, this kid. There's somebody in your life that is this guy. Then we got Buddy, I can't even remember his name, but he comes out and he's, he's one of those actors from Leave It to Beaver. Just, hey ho, I'm so excited to be in the zombie apocalypse. I'm so excited, zombies, yes. And then we have uh, his girlfriend who heard the extent of her acting ability is, but why does it have to be you? I don't know, because it just does, because I know how to run things. <laughs> but why does it have to be you? But why does it have to be you? I don't know. And, <laughs> and then they die, thank God. Then we have uh, Harry's wife, uh, Helen, who, she's actually a decent actress, which is cool. She does a good job. And she's one of the actors that you don't actually hate in the movie. Like, you watch and you're like, ah, oh, you're not too bad. Which is good, because most of them you do hate. And then we got, like, a militia of men that are, Mississippi went crazy and was, Savage! Yeah! Savage! God! We're ready! Like, they were just, like, expecting this to happen. So, the guy on the news, he's a terrible reporter. They're literally, literally he says, they are devouring the flesh off of their victims. He says it like 15 times in the same news segment. Just in different ways. What's hey, we got it. Thanks. Romero really wanted us to understand that these things were eating people. Like, oh my god, I know. They're eat okay, they're eating people. Thanks. Good to know. But it's a classic. And it's pretty good. Watch it if 
you really like horror movies and you're really into the whole how horror came around because it's it's one of those movies and it's good it's i mean you watch it it's not painful to watch you know you get through it it's not like oh my god it's not no i mean it's not mind-blowing or anything but it's good and it's original for the time you look at it like that it's cool because it's so just original if you're into that and you really want to like see how zombies were born into hollywood night of living dead just thing get it get on that that's the review ah!